This here is the most expensive package I've had to pay for. Hello, everybody. How are you all doing? My name is Morgan, and today you are watching Yes, Epic, Yes. We are going to be doing a fan unboxing of, well, boxes sent by fans. Um, this is not your usual compilation of fails and whatnot. Hope you guys are okay with that, that we're adding a bit of variety to the channel and whatnot. Make sure to subscribe if you're new, and let's go ahead and get into this. Gotta make sure that I'm not showing my address. Yep, it's on that side. So this first package here, box seems a little beat up, but not too bad. So I have no idea what you guys have sent. I'd be a liar if I said I was a little bit worried. I wanna make sure I'm not showing my address on any of these. And I also, I wanna make sure that I don't uh, break anything. Okay. So straight off the bat, just gonna cover this here. We have a whole lot of what looks to be like newspaper. To them in a second. We have what appears to be a Samsung Dex, but it's definitely not a Samsung Dex. Is there a phone in here? Okay, so I don't know what iPhone this is, but okay, so we have an uh, an iPhone there. It looks like definitely one of the older models, without doubt. I don't know if it's worth anything. And then there's just a Samsung DeX instruction manual and box. Thanks to whoever sent me a phone, I guess. Um, I might sell it on eBay because I personally don't have much use for it. And we have a Bose speaker. If this thing works, then this is a pretty expensive item. Um, let me let me go get my iPad and I can see if this thing works. Okay, so I have my iPad here and the speaker, which seemingly turned on. Hey, Bluetooth. Searching for device. Hey, that's not bad. I mean, how much are these things going for? These things are going for like 150 euro. Pounds. That's like 200 euro. I mean, thanks to whoever sent me an entire speaker. I don't know what you were really thinking, but I mean, I, I wanted a speaker. It's definitely gonna be used to me. I mean, thanks, I guess. You know, cheers. I'm gonna put these over here, actually. And keep everything sorted together. So we got an iPhone 5 and a Bose Soundlink Revolve. If every single package in this is as good as that, I'm gonna be pretty damn happy. Okay, there we go. We have here what appears to be a pretty bashed up package. Um, it's it's just sort of sealed with a small bit of tape on the back here. Whoever sealed a package going across these with sellotape, you're a madman. Okay, so we have Grand Theft Auto V PS4 edition. And bad Samaritan. But the question is, are they really in their actual boxes? <laughs> no. So what we have what we have here is Dr. Little 3. And a note. Hey Morgan, I really love your videos. I thought I would send you Bad Samaritan because I believe that's what you are. And Dr. Little 3 because of your small pe Okay, on to Bad Samaritan. And this one is actually sealed in its wrapper, so 
Now there is there is a uh, opening here, but I assume that they can't really just put a DVD in. So let's see what we're looking at. No, okay, so yeah, it's it it is it's actually in there. It's Bad Samaritan. So thanks, I guess. Five star gripping, auxiliary, and shocking. Knuckle chewing suspense. We we have an entire tripod case here. Um, I don't really know what to expect out of this. It does scare me a little bit. I took it out of its original uh, box because I assumed that it was something for me, as I do actually, actually, I actually have a tripod coming in um, to upgrade my studio. Um, but as soon as I saw, I'll show it to you here, all this tape on the front, I realized that this, this was obviously meant for uh, packaging unboxing. So, in me trying to take off the sellotape, I pushed the tab in. Okay, so, oh, we have a small wired, oh, I don't know, it's charge. Small wired speaker here. Music Angel Friend, Music Angel Friends, which by the branding looks like it should come from 2002. Okay, so. I mean, it definitely works. It's nowhere as good as the uh, the bows over here in sound quality, but I suppose, I suppose, um, what can you expect? It's obviously a much cheaper speaker. Thank you. You guys seem to know that I've needed a speaker for a while now. Um, and let's see what is in the rest here. I cannot... There is an actual tripod in here. It's not, it's not the uh, Montoto that the box branding originally said. It's a pretty light tripod. What do I mean, hey? It's not bad. It's, it has a quick release fitting on it. It definitely seems like a budget tripod. I don't know the branding. It's a uh, Cobra Eclipse 24. But I mean, it's pretty legit. Thank you to whoever sent me a tripod and a mini speaker. I've been needing this speaker and I've ordered a tripod. Um, looks like this. It looks as a little bit as though this has been jammed, um, because this is not this is not moving. Ah, oh, there we go. Just need a little twist. I mean, thanks. I'll find a use for it. We'll uh, stand the tripod right over here. These are usually what posters come in. Um, I have got a few myself and this is usually what they come in, except if you can see there, this thing has been butchered. But nevertheless, let's see what is inside of package numero. I assume that it's a poster. What is inside? It is a poster. Oh, cool. It's an actual, uh, it's a Breaking Bad poster, which is an awesome TV show if you haven't seen it. It is amazing. Um, I, I love the storyline of Breaking Bad and the characters in that, Jesse Pinkman and Walter White. And I, if you haven't seen Breaking Bad in 2019, you don't deserve to watch TV anymore, but that's really awesome. Um, I don't really know where I can put it. No, not really. But uh, I will definitely hang it up. Thank you. This here, I'm gonna, you know, have to sort of. This here is a very beat up package. It looks as though somebody got their grandma a beater across the face with the package and then sent it to me. Let's see what's inside. This part here doesn't have my main address, it just has a few contact details. But, um, so I'm gonna do it this, I'm gonna do it this way. Like that. And across. Okay, so we have a whole load of 
packaging paper, which I'm just going to instantly, if you guys want to have a look there, we can see we have a phone box. It is a Samsung Galaxy A50 box and a, what appears almost to be like a GoPro mount, I'm going to say. I mean, I don't own a GoPro. Not, not, not the best one we've received, if I'm honest with you. I'm just gonna put that over there. I wonder, is there an A50 inside? Um, there isn't. Um, yep, it's opened. It's an A50 box. I can tell by the weight. There's no, there's no phone in here. They didn't make an attempt. But there is a cable, some sorts. Oh, they're the earbuds. They're the earbuds and the packaging. I could sell this on eBay for like 10 quid, so cheers, I guess. We have two more boxes left. We have this one here, which if I'm honest with you, I'm a little bit nervous about because they're moving things in here. And which side do I go? comes away like that. There's a tag on the top here. HHH hunting. Seven self rest air gun shooting target. All right, so what it looks like here is somebody has sent me their calculator with a big old score in the center of it. I don't know if you can see that or not. There's a big old mark in the center and they've sanded the hell out of the back of it. A bouncy ball. You see, I've read online that the bouncy balls apparently have more germs than anything else. Because they bounce on the floor, they bounce on the ground, and people pick them up and they have sweaty hands. And they apparently, they keep a lot of their germs. You see, the thing is, I don't care. I don't understand some people, to be honest with you. I don't really understand why you would waste money on sending me a bouncy ball and a working calculator, to be fair to you. I mean, thanks, I guess. It looks like a gener generally decent one. It's pretty pretty beaten up, but I guess I could use it. Yeah, I, I won't be keeping this. Our final package. You... You made me spend 14 euro on delivery. I hope you understand this. The packages that you send can't be above a certain weight, and a certain size. You didn't listen to either of my recommendations. This here is the most expensive package I've had to pay for, for something that I have no idea what could be inside. Somebody could have gone outside to their back garden, picked up a block of concrete and thrown it in a box and sent it to me. Um, but I wanted to make this video, I wanted something interesting, and I heard that there's an oversight parcel, it's very heavy, do you want us to home deliver it? I pretty much said to them, Yes, please send me the package, I'll pay the delivery charges, and it came in, and there's a, like, half of the box isn't parted together, I don't know if that was my postage company or not, and, like, half the box is just ripped to shreds, it's like somebody, like, you see here how these sort of peel away like that, it's like somebody did that to the entire top of the box. Now, to be fair to them, it looks like there's a rip here, I don't know if maybe the po postage company opened it before sending it to me. I figured that because I was gonna have it as home delivery, they didn't need to reseal it. It got to me what seems to be in one piece. I have just no idea what on earth this item. We have what appears to be an Xbox One box and a whole load of packaging paper inside. Just gonna put this over here so you guys can see. I don't know what I'm taking out at the moment. Man, is it heavy. Okay, so, it's a PlayStation 2. Why? Did they send any of the cables? No, no, they just, they just sent me a PlayStation, a PlayStation 2. Also, don't, don't be annoyed or don't be upset if I sell your, sell your stuff. Um, I realize that some of you guys really do put a bit of thought into, into what you send me and things like the speakers and the DVD and the, the, the stand here, I'm definitely gonna use because I can actually, I, I have a use for them. But when you send me a dusty 
old PlayStation 2 with no power lead, no controllers, no games, nothing, I'm going to sell your item. I, 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 don't, I don't want a PS, a PS2 that I can't do anything with. Of course, pretty good. And then we also have an Xbox One box over here. The Battlefield Early in Style. All right, Early Enlister Deluxe Edition. Microsoft, yeah, it's the full, it's full packaging. Now, if you notice, this box has been resealed and is not, is not at its normal, its normal height. It is very much above what it should be. I wonder, is there an Xbox One inside? You know, what the smart thing would be to do is to put an Xbox 360 in here. I'm a little bit nervous about this one, if I'm completely honest. It literally could just be an X1, it could be an Xbox One box full of rubbish that I paid 14 euro worth of delivery for. And if it is, I'm gonna be pretty upset. I got the guy's return address and I got his name and I found him in one of my comments and I responded to him and I said, hey, did you send me a package? Um, it's an oversized package, I'm gonna have to pay extra delivery for it. Is there any point in me spending money on getting this package delivered? Have you just filled it up with rubbish? But what this guy said to me was kind of intriguing. He said, I promise you, you will never get a package like this from a fan again. So instantly my brain started saying, okay, well look, it's either really weird and disgusting or really be up and above and beyond. Okay, so let's move this PlayStation 2 a little bit out of the way. And I'm going to put the box, this is a heavy box. Like this feels, this feels heavier than an Xbox One should. But I have, I have no idea what's in this currently. I'm showing you guys, I have no idea what's currently in this. It could be literally just full, full of rubbish. You're not gonna talk? Alright, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll look myself. The hell? There's a games console in here. Hold on a second. There's a, there's a console in here. Wait, somebody, somebody sent me a PS4. It, it's, it's an actual, it's an... The hell? Is it, is it intact? Is it working? He didn't send any of the cables, and he, di he didn't send a note, but it's it's a full-on PS4. It, it just uses one of those one of those normal uh, adapters. Do I have a plug nearby? No, I don't. Um, I mean, he was right with what he said about it's something like I'll never have before. Let me see if I can get something. Hey guys, so sorry if this was slightly blocking the view there. Um, my two pin plug, which I believe will work on this because as far as I'm aware, Xbox and PlayStation both use the same two pin plug. Um, and I've got an extension lead here for my monitor and the PS4, um, which is absolutely insane, which might explain possibly the same guy sent me the Bose speaker with the empty box. That would actually make a lot of sense because I mean, he sends, he first, sends a crap item that you think, ah, oh, well, this guy doesn't know what he's doing, and then sends a Bose speaker. <laughs> I don't know if maybe that's what's happened here, but um, let's go ahead, this, I've got my HDMI cable here, and my monitor's cable here. Uh, where is the HDMI plug? Okay, so, our HDMI cable is plugged in, our monitor is plugged in, now the moment of truth, whether or not the free PS4 sent to me by one of you guys actually works. If you've actually sent me a working PS4, then you are <laughs> for absolute certain the best fan that I have. And you are completely right with you will never get a fan like this again. Okay, I'm plugging her in in three, two, one. 
That's it. It's plugged in. Has it come on? Maybe I need to. Maybe I need to start it up or something. Um, is there like a button or something on the front here? There. You see, I I don't own a PS4. I own an Xbox. Ah, there's a little button here. Oh, it 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 made a noise. It made a noise. All right, my monitor's off. Let me turn it on. Okay, my ASUS monitor and the fan. It's running. There's fan spit. Uh, sorry about that guys, my, my camera there died, uh, ran out of battery. I was in the middle of saying that I was uh, going to contact this guy um, who sent me this. I'll buy a few controllers off you or whatever. Um, let me let me know if there's anything I can do to show you my appreciation because this is just genuinely insane. Um, thank you very much. Anyway guys. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to Yes Epic Yes. Uh, sorry, <laughs> I'm a little bit lost for words, um, and it's one of the worst times for my camera to die. Um, make sure to subscribe to Yes Epic Yes. Turn on bell notifications. Follow any social media comments. You know the drill. Um, and thank you guys so much for watching. I need to go and email this guy.